basically what this machine is, it is a, everybody's heard about these things, it's a PCR machine. Okay, so it, it detects various viral and bacterial illnesses, all from the all too familiar swab. Now, not everybody that comes in with a cough, cold, headache, fever, has COVID. The question is, what if your cough, cold, headache, fever, etc., turns out to be negative on COVID? What do you have? And this is where this machine really steps up. You're, in essence, doing 22 different tests from one sample. So if a physician um, needs to get a diagnosis the traditional way, you are talking time for each individual test that needs to be run. Um, I think the current labs in Grenada may have the ability to do three or four tests from one sample, but now you're talking 22 different tests from one sample. So time is of the essence when you're sick to get those results back. So by doing this, it allows us very quickly, within an hour, to discern what the cause of your respiratory infection is, and we can get to work on you and treat you appropriately. You're now practicing evidence-based medicine as opposed to clinically based and simply guessing in some cases, which unfortunately in happens. So the more the more science-driven your diagnosis is, the more evidence-based it is, the better your, your care of your patient can be. The, the main difference of this machine versus what a standard PCR test would do is that a standard PCR does several phases. You have to extract the, the um, swab, you have to do a number of um, preparations to the sample before you um, enter it into a PCR machine. This takes the swab and it does everything in that closed system. So there's no extra steps and that's why it's able to do it at such a, a high rate of speed. This biofire system is FDA approved. It's approved in Europe as well. So it's not some sort of fly by night thing that we have fallen into our laps and we're dealing with. And the accuracy for testing is you've got a sensitivity of close to 97% okay, and a specificity of close to 100% on this machine. So it is, you're dealing with, with serious business here and you can have great confidence in your results. We've also moved forward in, in, in SAMS to try and modernize what we're doing. We now have, we're using an electronic medical record system, okay, where it's helping us to move away from paper. We're really trying to move toward a more of a green workflow in here however it also there's something else that ha happens with this it helps you to capture data better it helps you to streamline systems better it, it helps you to preserve your records better and the person that benefits from that really is the patient added to that we also now have a patient portal part and parcel of this here emr system where you the patient come to see me you do all your signing and registering in you register for the patient portal and you can now go online and access your records. So instead of having me print out a piece of paper which can get wet, can get lost, can fade over time, you can have a digital record of everything that you've done here in SAMS. A patient, once they come and they get their swab, they don't even um, have to come back for results. Those results are either emailed electronically to the patient or they can go to the um, patient portal and download it themselves. So what this does is that not only um, does it help with the green initiative, but it also helps with your time management as a patient, um, contact with paper, contact with other people, because now all of that back and forth to get results is, is pretty much eliminated.